All right, hey guys, what's going on? It's that home theater dude. Got a brand new episode for you today. As you can see in front of me, I have the Prime Elevations. These are for actually the 1 million views giveaway. I'm gonna be giving these to Adam Yonke. These are going out to Alabama. These are uh, brand new, black ash. You get the full uh, SVS warranty with these things. So uh, hope you enjoy this, man. I'm gonna go ahead and send these out tomorrow. But for right now, I gotta go ahead and get to this big box down here. This big box is the PV16 Ultra. And as you can see over here, I have the S or the SBS PV4000, right? Um, if you've been following the channel a long time, I started out with uh, Klipsch uh, speakers and subwoofers. I switched to their SB4000, and then uh, for some reason, I decided just to go with, go ahead and go with the PV4000. So this thing's a monster. It's been killing the the <laughs> it's, it's been killing all the demos and uh, the, the movies in my house for a long time. Really, really enjoy that one. Um, I know you guys really enjoyed it too. It's a 13 and a half inch driver, three and a half inch ports down there, 1200 watts RMS. Uh, that thing is an absolute monster. It's uh, basically the little brother of this one. Um, from what I understand, they actually had this one first and then they detuned that one to create that one, kind of a, almost like a reverse engineer, which is kind of like a, um, they, they took all the, the guts from this one and just made it a little smaller. And this one is amazing. Uh, if you have the space, definitely recommend going ported, um, but you don't necessarily have to do that. If you're following SVS like I do, they've been doing a lot of uh, contests and around the world, and actually in Germany, different magazines, and all kinds of other things like that. It keeps winning sub, like best sub of the year, like, um, and, 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 di and different things like that. So I, I keep saying the same sort of thing because I want to get you guys to understand that these are world-class subs, and if you think that you can't get that in your house, then... Uh, <laughs> you might be mistaken. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump in this unboxing real quick. Um, and then we'll talk about the SBS uh, shimmy, which is what almost every single person does whenever they unbox one of these big ported subwoofers. So as you can see in my house, I pretty much changed everything out to uh, SBS. I only have my Klipsch uh, towers, the R RP2E's. I only have those as my um, rear surround right now, which is kind of sacrilegious, you know, because they're really great speakers. I don't mean to mistreat them, but <laughs> I just don't have the, the space form in the system that I'm building right now. So a lot of you were kind of bummed with the giveaway that it, it wasn't worldwide, that the speakers were only available uh, in America, and uh, I did that for a reason um, because like it, sometimes if I do open things up like to worldwide, here's that uh, shimmy that I was talking about. The sub shimmy. So you gotta get in there. Oh crap. Hey, you gotta open this one first. You gotta get in there and give it a push. All right, so everyone looks like that whenever they do this unboxing. But yeah, like I was saying, like uh, some people were bummed that the uh, giveaway wasn't worldwide. Next one will be. So if you guys want to stay tuned to the channel, I'm just starting to do all these giveaways, so very fresh idea for me. You guys have seen me do this a ton of times. Very uh, similar things in every single box. Get your power cord, credit card remote, warranty information. Three of the foam ports. So same thing with this one, with that one. You get the option to plug these ports up if you want all three of them plugged up, you can have kind of like a sealed configuration. Or you can go into your SVS app, change it, just have one plugged. It's called the extended mode. So these things go down subsonic, right? They go down below what you can hear. So it'll pulse the room, like it'll pressurize the room. 
and you'll feel it. Like you can, you can feel it on your skin, and you won't necessarily be able to hear it, but it's it's it's, it's a really cool feature, and that's why people are really excited about these subs. If I'm not mistaken, this might be the same grill for this one. Maybe, maybe not. Nah, I don't think so. <laughs> it's too big. So if you guys saw in that other video I did, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to recreate on this one too. But uh, whenever I did that video, you can actually see the this metal grill flex whenever the base starts going full tilt. So one thing I will say with these, whenever you're starting to do the unboxing, what I like to do is whenever you get them in, basically whenever you're ready, scoop this thing around to where you want it, right? Because you have, typically you're going to have carpet, you're going to have something under there. These are cardboard, so it creates a better uh, barrier of friction, so they're easier to move rather than having to grab someone, pick this thing up, because this is 174.5 pounds. This thing's a freaking monster. So for demonstration purposes, I'm just going to go ahead and open it up right here. And I opted to go with the piano gloss for this one. I couldn't pass it up. <laughs> This one's black ash. My rear uh, SVS prime elevations are black ash as well. I just love that, so I couldn't uh, I couldn't pass up going with the the classiness of the piano black finish. get here 16 inch driver three inch three and a half inch ports you get the same type of configuration for the front as you do with uh, the 4000 and on the back this is where all the magic is 1500 watts RMS this thing can go up to 5000 watts but you got the standard stuff back here Input, output. If you want to use balanced inputs, you can do that as well. Balanced outputs, or input, output, and then got your power cord down there, power switch. So that's it. I'm going to go ahead and pull the other one out so we can get it side by side. All right, so let's get a quick comparison of what they look like side by side. So they're lined up on the back pretty, pretty good. So if you look back here, they're lined up really good. And then this one sticks out a slight bit up front. Another thing that I would notice is that whenever you're looking at them side by side, this one is with the elevation or the SVS sound path um, system on it. So it has those uh, little feet on the bottom, right? So it lifts it up. This one has zero feet. So if you add the feet to it, the sound path isolation system, you'll notice that this one is gonna get a little bit higher. So as I noticed before, whenever I did my measurements, this one barely fits under my projector, or my uh, projector screen. So this one with the feet probably isn't gonna fit, but hopefully I'll be getting a new screen soon, so uh, <laughs> I'll be able to remount it anyway. So that's not really a big problem. But look at the sheer difference in size of these things. So you got 13 and a half inch driver, 16 inch driver. Just look at the presence of this thing that it has in the house. It's crazy. So one thing I will say, highly reflective surface, right? Um, if you're worried about having it next to a TV, next to a projector, next to a projector screen, basically you're worried about reflections, put a little uh, cloth over the top of it. You'll never have to worry about any of that distracting glare or anything like that. I have my uh, Piano Black 
towers kicked out so far that you don't get any glare off of them at all. But that's it. So I know everyone got kind of bummed in the last video that I didn't turn them on uh, whenever I had dual subs in here last time. But rest assured, new videos of these are coming out soon and both of them are going to be firing at the exact same time. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead in this video here. If you guys like any of this stuff, let me know. Uh, ask for the links. I have links for all the stuff in the description as well. If you guys want stuff to SVS, let me know. Amazon, let me know. And I can also do, uh, I also have my Facebook page and my Instagram page. All right, guys, that's it. I'm going to go ahead in this video here. Thanks for watching. Catch you all next time.